shots. Van Staffordshire in goal, Harry's Minoga and Dice, the three centre-backs. Carfield and Jones, the wing-backs, Glover and Frost in midfield. Josh Stokes behind Tolladge and Parham. It's for or against all shot. Minogan needs to be very careful from here on in. The referee giving him the benefit of the doubt there if he saw it at all. His glove, old shot, keeping the ball from a throw in. Now you give it to Dice. You can make a little bit of ground forward. And uh, now he looks for an option. Clips the ball into the post, looking for Aaron Jones. He does really well to lift it over the keeper. And it's just wide. Brilliant acrobatic effort there from Aaron Jones, the captain. And he got it over Walker, and it must have just gone inches, maybe a foot at most, past Walker's right-hand post. Against Aldershot Town, who start the night in 14th place. Here's Zach Brunt picking up the ball in midfield. Out left to Idris Kanu. He's one-on-one -on -one against Aaron Jones, one of three Aldershot Town players on a yellow card already. Overlapping run, goes for the return, tries to keep it in. It's snaffled away at the near post by Jordi van Stapershoef. It's going to come back in from Barnett. Header is on from the Barnet player, it goes behind it, it'll be a goal kick. Now, interesting one, there's no doubt that Jordi didn't catch that cleanly, but didn't he recover well from uh, Mansfield? Another one with the Football League experience. Barnet through the middle, flicked on by Kabamba to the edge of the area, and Armstrong's in, and it's a good point-blank save from Jordi van Staffelschuur. It's going to take a corner left-footed. Is he going to play it short to Carnu? He is. Carnu's going to give it back to him. Brunt comes back on his right foot, Stokes tries to make a tackle and can't, Kid Idris Kanu into the air, to the far post, header, downwards, and it's that man again, Danny Collins, fifth goal of the season, he's stayed up, he's got on the end of it, and one minute before half-time, the home side have got it their way again, Barnet won, Aldershot nil. Well, we just spoke about how well Aldershot have done in stopping crosses, this time it's from a corner, it's a short corner, but they only send one defender up. So Zach Brunt and Idris Kanu know they're two against one. They work it really well, and Kanu ends up being able to get a free cross and just dinks it into the middle. Collins does what he's been doing all season, gets ahead of his man and gets a header on target into the corner of the goal. Really, really well worked corner from a Barnet perspective, but definitely one that could have been prevented from, from an order shot perspective. Hartigan gives the ball to Hall Johnson, who throws it down the line. Harfield not sure whether to deal with it or not. He does deal with it. He hooks it away over his head. Pritchard heads it up in the air. Glover gets contact on it, but can only find Hartigan. Hartigan out to the right-hand side to Hall Johnson. Hall Johnson cuts in, then he goes back out. Now he finds Armstrong. Armstrong back to Collins. Collins with the ball inside to Hartigan. Has one touch, clips the ball into the far post. Another header on target from Kabamba and snaffled at the second attempt by Jordi van Stapershoek. Drags a ball on the floor and gets his pass wrong and Marvin Armstrong cuts it out. That's poor from Harris and Barnett on the counter-attack now with Hall Johnson. He's bombed past Dice, squares the ball in. And it was a cross, but it's gone all the way in. I'm sure it was a cross. And it's caught Jordi van Stapershoek out and it's gone right across the front of him and nestled in at the far post. Barnet 2, Aldershot Town nil. When that cross has come in, I think, I think it's Kabamba that's got on the end of it and he's just... Sort of has he just got a touch? I think Kabamba's just guided it into the, into the far post. Right, that's it what's was, happened, yeah. It was a magnificent break down the right hand side. All Johnson shows a clear set of heels to the defender. Whips the ball in and then Kabamba has the easiest, easiest task of just guiding it on target and he does it brilliantly. Guides it into the corner, ninth goal of the season, and keeps himself at the top of that top goal scorer's chart. Yeah. Gives Barnett a 2 0 lead. Barnett will come out with even more confidence after going in at, at half time with a 1 0 lead. Finishing that half really strongly. They've come out and they've, they've picked up where they left off. And getting that, getting that second goal so early into the second half will only make things even harder for, for the order shot players. And, and, you know, almost demoralise them. Barnett will be looking to try and go on and, and get another. Shots through the middle, Barham picks up the ball, he's into the area, shoots, it's saved by the feet of Laurie Walker. Stokes gets free and the ball to Barham's not, not good enough. 
and then that one there, Tollard gets away and then Collins just, just Man, defends really well. Sorry, Aaron, Manoga with a good ball. Stokes shoots, great shot, best effort of the night. Walker keeping the shots out, in comes the corner from Harfield. Tollard in, goal! Shots have got one back. Tollard has got his first goal since the start of the season. And Laurie Walker's been shown a yellow card. But Aldershot Town won't care. They're back in this game, Aaron. And it's Laurent Tullage with his third goal of the season and his first ones uh, since the opening day. Brilliant. Brilliant header. You know, just out-muscles his defender, gets a flick, and all he needs to do is guide it on target. You know, again, the pace is on the ball. All you need to do is get good connection on it. He guides it into the far corner and gets all the shot within a, within a goal. Most definitely. For a striker, you'd want to be getting yourself on the score sheet when you go eight games. Frost bursting through the middle, he's just got the edge on Collins, tries to square it across, Tollard, oh, brilliant block, back out to Frost to the far edge, and Glover might get a shot away. Stokes does, and it's straight at Walker, and he comes away with the ball. He's having a terrific game, he's running into space across the middle, now he finds his pass to Stokes, who drifts onto it, has to turn, he's got an overlapping run, and that's coming now from Harfield and uh, the substitute I think it is has just towed it into touch but all the shot take the throw quickly and Glover's coming towards the edge of the box so he's going to try a shot from distance he does it's a really good effort and he's parried just behind for a corner by Walker who balls out his defenders here's Pritchard picking the ball up just inside his own half out to the right hand side Paul Johnson inside to Senior Senior inside to College Collins advances to the end of the area. Is he going to try a shot? He does. It's point blank saved by Jordi Van Staffordshire. Here in added time at the end of added time. Minoga holding it up, twisting, turning, trying to get room for a cross. He's having his shirt pulled off his back and he's battling away. He's still battling away. Barnett have now got it. Senior's got it down by the corner flag. Minoga's won it back again. He's into the penalty area, squares it across. It's cut out by Barnett. Minoga goes down a bit too easily. And Barnett will clear off the Aldershot Town player. And there is the final whistle. And it ends Barnett 2, Aldershot Town 1.